Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh We are from Group C and our topic is Cultivating the use of public transport to strive the sustainability From our research, indeed, the use of public facilities such as local public transport and pedestrian zones offer a ton of benefits to cities To back up our claim, let's look at example Copenhagen in Denmark which is regarded as number one on being a sustainable city It's also number two for having the best air quality across Europe. How did the Danish government achieve such good air quality? The key was public transport. The Danish government invested a lot of their budgets into highly developed public transport system. The people of Denmark also have a culture of cycling everywhere they go in all types of weather. To support this culture, the government has invested a lot into bike infrastructure such as building a cycle super highway which covers 300 km in Copenhagen alone for the cyclists. This ensures the safety of the cyclists and encourages more people to use a bike to get around, thus decreasing CO2 emission from private vehicles. With majority using bikes, it is no surprise that they are contributing a lot to goal 13 of the SDG, which is climate action. Copenhagen is also known for their intelligent bus priority system. Everywhere across the world, bus are used to transport people, but little do people know that the bus system in Denmark is much more efficient and cost-effective. The government has taken a lot of initiatives such to promote the use of public transport, such as uniquely dedicated bus lanes, which get green lights before other vehicles in traffic. These results show that the bus lane saves more time during rush hour than using personal vehicles. While using diesel bus isn't that efficient, The Denmark government has been slowly transitioning to using electric buses to provide transport in a greener way to the whole country. From what we have presented, it is no doubt that if this research is carried out and implemented properly, our country Malaysia could also reach the same level as Denmark.